Five o'clock, we got Middle Tennessee State traveling to UTSA. I'm sure you're wondering, GGB, why are you predicting this game? It's a nothing game. UTSA is still, technically speaking, unde an undefeated team. And, uh, yeah, so that means they're still in playoff contention. Now, obviously, the number of games I predict will go down as the season goes along, as there's less playoff-eligible teams. Um, but the fact is, this week, there is still... UTSA is still a playoff-eligible team. The Roadrunners are still a playoff-eligible team. UTSA has surprised me this year so far. I, I expected the win against Illinois. Did not expect them to be undefeated heading into this game. Middle Tennessee State gave uh, Virginia Tech quite a scare last week mm, for the first half. But then, obviously, they got blown out in the second half. But you gave a top-15 team like Virginia Tech a half. I think that's an impressive win if you're Middle Tennessee State and you're the Blue Raiders. You need to have faith coming into this game. Um, obviously, you're 12 and a half point underdogs. But the Blue Raiders need to get it together. They need to travel to UTSA. It's like Middle Tennessee State needs to hit a bowl game this year. And right now, they're I think they're sitting at like a one and one record. Right? They have the win against Monmouth Week One, and then they had the win, the loss against Virginia Tech Week Two. This is a game that you kind of have to pull out if you're Middle Tennessee State. Um, there's going to be tougher games on the Conference USA schedule. You've probably still got Marshall. Um, UAB, like, this is going to be tough if you're Mar uh, Middle Tennessee State and you want to make a bowl game. This is a game that you kind of have to have. And UTSA, you want to be considered one of the top teams in the conference, you say? Like, mentioned in the names of Marshall and UAB, um, this is a game you got to win. Like, UTSA needs to prove that they are their competitor in the conference, USA uh, realm. Uh, I really like the Roadrunners this year. They've looked good. They've looked solid. I'm impressed with what I've seen out of the Roadrunners this year. They destroyed Illinois in week two, week one, week one. Because week zero, Illinois played no one and then they lost to UTSA week one. Um, I think UTSA looks really good. I don't think Middle Tennessee State has it in them to upset the Roadrunners. But I think this could be a closer game than a lot of people realize. Give me Middle Tennessee State to cover, but UTSA to win.